You found Paul and Eddie's Blind Hog Barbecue. Today's video, I've got ranch style drumsticks for you. Now this is a simple recipe. It's quick, easy, and good. <laughs> All right, my recipe calls for four drumsticks, but you can expand it as needed. All the ingredients that you're gonna need besides the drumsticks, Italian dressing or zesty Italian. You can use olive oil if you don't have the Italian. We also need one one ounce package of ranch dips mix or ranch dressing mix, one teaspoon cayenne pepper, a half teaspoon of salt, and one tablespoon of black pepper. But of course, you should feel free to adjust that salt, pepper, and cayenne to your taste. But keep in mind that the ranch dressing mix has salt in it as the number two ingredient, and so that half teaspoon of salt should be the little half. Place the drumsticks in a Ziploc bag and then add just enough zesty Italian to give them a good coating, and then you want to add the other ingredients. Zip up that bag, give it a good toss, and then we're gonna put this in the fridge while you bring your oven, your grill or smoker up to temperature. And I'm gonna be cooking these on my propane grill. And I have a three burner grill, but I'll be using two of the burners. The drumsticks will go over the unlit burner. And this way I've got indirect heat. But I'll put a pan underneath the chicken to catch any drippings. And I'm using a silicone mat to help minimize the cleanup. And when you get through, just throw that mat in the dishwasher. Now my target grill temperature is 300 degrees and a lot of recipes call for drumsticks to cook to 165, but I'm old school and my preferred range for dark meats between 180 and 185. I don't want the meat sticking to the bone, but if you like it at 165, then that's the way you should cook it. But ever how you cook it, you need a good instant read thermometer such as a thermopin. And when the chicken's done, it's when it hits your target temperature. Now everybody's rig's gonna be cooking differently and using indirect heat's always gonna take a little bit longer, but it takes whatever it takes. Now, one note on cooking these, you may hit 165 in that first hour, but going up to 180, 185, if you choose to do that, it's gonna take quite a bit more time, so just be patient. Now just look how good these drumsticks look. Absolutely delicious. This is an awesome recipe. I highly recommend that you give it a try. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please hit that like button on your way out. Consider subscribing. And I hope to see you next time at Paul Daddy's Blind Hog Barbecue.